Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and this is Edmir with another video for you this week. In uh, today's video, I will be talking about four desserts that I like in the Philippines. Um, there's plenty of uh, Filipino desserts that are really, really good. And I can't show them all here um, in this one video. So I'm just gonna pick four and in future video, I'm gonna show you another four. But this is uh, my favorite ones. So I have um, Biko Ube, which is right here. So good. And then I also have um, Puto Bongbong, which is right here. So good. And then I also have Palitao, which is right here. Mmm, that looks so, so good. And then um, I have Royal Bibinka, which is right there. Yummy. So let me show you. Um, let me show you the item, and then I'm gonna go ahead and bite them and try them out. Mmm, I can't wait. So um, let's start with the Biko Ube. So Biko Ube is a sticky rice cake type dessert mixed with ube flake and coconut milk. So let's try this out. Let me put this on the side. Let's gonna try this out first. So um, let's see, I'm gonna just gonna dig into this. I'm gonna grab a piece here. Oh my god, it looks so good. All right, let me go back here. You see, purple. It's because of the ube. You know, ube is popular in the Philippines. Um, it's purple. And I'm not sure what this one is. This is like a flake. I think, I'm guessing that's the coconut flake. Mmm. That's good. This is so good. I highly recommend it if you like rice cakes. This is really good. I don't know how I'm gonna eat all this. It's really good. All right, so that was so good. Let's try another dessert, and we're gonna try putu bong bong. And putu bong bong is basically a dessert that's eaten after midnight masses in the Philippines. And it's a type of rice cake that's topped with brown sugar, margarine, and coconut meat. Let me grab a piece. Let's see, margarine. So this is the butter. This is how you eat it. So let's just put some here. All right, so let me show you. So right here is the dessert. You can see there, this is the margarine, and then you have the brown sugar. All right, let's dig in. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. So good. The brown sugar, it hits the spot. You can taste the, uh, the rice cake, and then after that, you get the hint of the brown sugar and then the aftertaste of the coconut meat. Mm, so good. And I have um, lemonade here. Mm. All right, let's go on to the next one. All right, so the next one on my list is the Royal Bibinka. So um, the Royal Bibinka is the most popular rice cake that is topped with cheese. It's sweet and savory and it's a Christmas dessert. Um, people eat this mostly during Christmas time. So, mmm, the cheese sounds good. So let's go and grab one. So that's how it looks like. Mmm, look at that, yummy. Mmm, 
It's so good. Mmm. This also has cream cheese. I can um taste it. This is so good. Filipinos do love their rice cakes. This one's really good though. Highly recommend it. They're so good. These first three things that I've um, eaten, I recommend them guys. You guys definitely need to try them. This one's the sweetest one out of the, the first three. So let's go into the fourth one. So the last one on my list is the dessert called Palitao. And Palitao is a flat sweet rice cake that's eaten either a snack or a dessert. And it's mixed with coconut flakes and sesame seeds. Mm, mm, mm. I remember back home when I was in the Philippines, they would make this for me. And they would make them fresh. And I would I would just eat this so much. I remember, and then coming back here to the States, I remember requesting this to be made. And I had my grandma make them too. Let me grab one of this. Let me show you. So it's like, it's all white because of the, um, this is coconut, coconut meat. So this is the sticky rice in there and then wrapped with coconut meat. And then you have the sesame seeds there. You can also add sugar on this if you'd like. Um, Mmm. So good. Reminds me of my childhood. Mm. It's like, it's really, really sticky and makes your mouth dry. I'm like stuck. And <laughs> it's already too late. I can't be eating it this late. This late. You guys don't know that, but it's really late. Trust me, when I say it's late, it's late. So, this is so good. I highly recommend it. Like, if you guys ever have any Filipino store by your house, or if you have um, a seafood city in your area, or if you know someone that is Filipino and then can cook for you, or like make a pastry for you, any one of these two, or any one of these four, I highly recommend it. It's so good. Alright guys, so this concludes the video for this week. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe button. And um, this was a really quick video. I wanted to show you um, a few of my favorite Filipino desserts. And hopefully these are also your favorite ones. But if not, leave a comment down below. Let me know which one is your favorite Filipino dessert. And if you want me to try any type of Filipino dessert, let me know because on my future video, I will be making that as well. I just want to say a quick thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you very much for subscribing. Uh, welcome to the family. And yeah, you will be seeing a lot more of me. I've been off for quite some time because of a convention that I attended but I will be back now in my regular daily program so I will be making videos once every week for you guys and thank you very much for watching and thank you very much everyone for for always giving me the love and the support thank you so much it means a lot to me all right till next time I will see you all on my next video